Hi, everybody. My name is Michelle Rydell, and I am a professor in the Department of Middle and Secondary Education. When I thought about the Black educators who have had an impact on me, I immediately had a picture in my mind of Mrs. Audrey Robinson, who was my first grade teacher. She was fabulous, and she gave me the gift of literacy. And I also thought about all the unnamed men and women who risked their lives to pass on that same gift of literacy to their fellow enslaved men and women in the, in the South when it was illegal to do so. So we don't know the names of many of those who took on this challenge and this risk in order to empower others. We know few, like Matilda Taylor, who ran a secret school in Savannah, and Lindy, Lin, Lily Ann Granderson, and also John Barry Meacham. In Meacham's case, Missouri did not initially have a law that outlawed uh, teaching reading and writing to freed black people or enslaved black people. And so he was actually running a school. But when the law was passed, they like shut that down. And in his brilliance, he realized that the Mississippi River is federal jurisdiction. So I'll just build a steamboat and take my school out onto the river. Awesome. He ran it for almost 30 years, if I remember correctly. But what I take away from learning the stories of these individuals and what they risked is it makes me think about how in the most difficult of circumstances, they found a way. And so it makes me constantly think about when I'm up against a challenge and I can't do that or I'm not allowed to do that. Or especially now when lots of teachers and teaching and particular topics are under attack, that we can find a way. Okay. Thank you.